For more than 30 years, the faded white lettering on a bridge above the M57 was beloved by drivers. Many will remember reading The Pies written on the well-known motorway bridge. This became a key landmark from drivers travelling home from outside the area. Relating to the Liverpool band The Pies, the group have maintained a cult status across Merseyside. Their name appears in unusual locations, also the M6, the M62 and the Mersey Tunnel ventilation shaft. But last year, many were left outraged after the iconic landmark had been defaced. The Pies are a Liverpool band who somehow managed to become a phenomenon. They managed it without anyone knowing much about their background. Formed in the late 80s and regulars on the Liverpool music scene, the original Pies split around 1993. The original graffiti was born after they became stuck on the bridge and didn't know what else to do. Guitarist, singer and songwriter Ashley Martin formed a new lineup around 2000. They later also performed on top of Walton Prison. The graffiti stayed up over 20 years and Alexi Sale used to say the council would paint around it. In 2016, The Echo reported the Pies said they were back and ready to record a debut album. This came 30 years after their name started appearing on motorway bridges across the northwest. Gomez had a B-side called M57 The Pies The Pies and Alexi Sale wrote his book Overtaken about them. Papamashi from The Pies previously said, The Pies The Pies M57 is loved by the people the length of the country. Northwesterns love it because they know their home. It is on the best graffiti of all time on many motorist lists. It's made a lot of people laugh a lot I mean belly laugh. It helped Alexi Sale make his first novel, Overtaken, where he devotes the first six pages, including the foreword, speculating hilariously about what it means and who did it. Gomez wrote a song about it. Let's just say it's legendary. It's been present for 25 of the last 27 years. It has been repainted recently by public demand. That bridge is owned by the people and will always say, the pies, the pies. However, in September 2020, people across Merseyside were outraged after the landmark was defaced. Targeted by coronavirus conspiracy theorists, the graffiti was replaced by the word Plandemic. Many were left in anger as the Pies music slogan has always been a key landmark to people returning home. At the time, Twitter user Helena shared a photo of the new graffiti and said RIP Pies music. People were quick to respond with their anger. Phil Torpy said, Absolutely gutted. Been there in one form or another since the 1980s. Christina said, This made me so angry on my way to work. Down Under Blue said, What? No more the pies? This was my welcome home point from the airport. Damn you 2020.